right, Josh. So a busy week for the for the teams, the men's and women's swimming teams. You had Westminster relays on Friday, and then got right back at it the next morning at Lake Erie. How was it? Was it taxing for yourself, for your teammates, to have to swim Friday night, quickly rest, and get right back into the pool on Saturday? I mean, it was. We raced pretty. We raced pretty well on Saturday, a lot better than we did on Friday. So, but that shows that our coaches. He knows what he's doing. Like he's getting co or us motivated to swim faster each day, and uh, I think we did a very good job of becoming from one meet resting and then going straight to another big meet. So I think we did a very well job of race getting up and race. And on Saturday, the team showed it as well with the scores with the men's team earning a big 130 to 66 win over Lake Erie. Uh, talk about how being able to get that first victory of the season and get it so early on to just get that out of the way and be able to focus on each meet individually now. The first victory is definitely, it was a good feeling, um, but that just set, that sets us up for more victories. The more you get, the more it's going to keep going. It's going to be a tradition and keep going on and on and on. And I'm definitely look, we're definitely looking forward to having a great season this year and having the first meet, that's, especially at Spire, is a great opportunity for swimmers to get their best times, and so it's going to set us up for Wooster and PSAX this year. So I think we're going to do a very well job at, at points-wise this year. You did. You had a solid outing against Lake Erie College as well. You had two wins plus a, another one in relay action as well. So was that kind of your mindset? What were your goals coming in, and how did you do compared to those goals at the end of the day on Saturday? My goals coming in was I focused mainly on the 1,000. Um, it's not my biggest strong point. Um, at that race particularly, but I came in with the mindset of like, I want to do well, I want to do, so I can get a good spot at PSAX, and I'm pretty I'm pretty happy with what I did, 500 went pretty well, it could, I got a decent time in that, and then the last relay, we just, I just did a, what I had left, and what a coach has been training us to do is just keep racing, keep racing, so I think my goals, I, I think I reached this weekend. In the beginning of your answer, you touched on the thousand-yard uh, freestyle, which you end up, which you did end up capturing the victory. And how was that? It, it, was it was it a grueling race? What was your mindset going on? Was there tough competition? It, expand on that. Is it was it honestly your toughest win of the three in the event on Saturday? On Saturday, um, it wasn't a, a tough win, but I came in the mindset that I I want to do well. I don't care who else is near next to me. I want to do well, so I went in the mindset of I'm just gonna get up and race. It doesn't matter. I'm I'm not racing for the people next to me. Racing for time and and during a season, and so, and it was it was a, a good win. Like I was very happy with it, and it brought points to the team. So I was very happy for that. So, how about the 500 yard pre freestyle? I mean, after already go already going a thousand yards, 500 can't seem that much of a tall task for you. But how was it to get back into the water and have to race that one? And end up being victorious as well. Uh, getting back in the water, I've been doing it since my freshman year, and this is I'm a junior now, so it's I'm kind of used to it by now. Um, so, it, getting back in the race and racing again just shows how much work that this your swim team here does, and it was nice having another victory and bringing those points to the team. Your last victory was in the 200-yard freestyle relay. You teamed with Chad Murphy, Nick Wilkinson, and Luke Frederick to get that winning time. What was that? You said you just gave it everything you got at the end. Uh, how was that in the relay? Were you guys down in the beginning? Kind of take us through how that relay went leg by leg. Uh, well, <clears throat> we were kind of down the, or to begin with. Uh, came back and uh, just we tried our hardest to just keep pushing, keep pushing, keep racing. And we ended up pretty well. So, And uh, it was just by the end, I was really tired. I was my muscles were fatigued. I was shaking on the blocks. So, but that... It's not. It's the mindset that's going to keep you pushing through, and it's, and I know that's a lot with all the swimmers. Is that the mindset? You keep that mindset, and it's going to get you through the races. You had th you, you've had three events thus far: the Spire Open, the Westminster Relays, and then your first dual meet, which ended up being victorious against Lake Erie College. So far, through three events in your junior season, what is your mindset about yourself as an individual, as a swimmer this year? What are you happy with it? What do you need to work on? How, what have you seen in those first three? Uh, meets of the year. I'm definitely happy. Um, I did at our first meet, the tri meet. I did very well. I placed second in the 500, and, and I was very, I was a best in season time. Uh, so that's gonna, that's just gonna give me a confidence booster for the season. 
and it's uh, hopefully just continue to do better as last year. Um, I just work on just small things, and so if once you work on those small things, it's going to put all together and become awesome during PSACs.